as we take a look at the Ethiopian stone cross-shaped building structure located in modern Lalibaba, we see the image of Nibiru that appears in the book of Psalms 105 chapter 23rd verse upon the original 12 African continent tribes that was illegally renamed in the 16th century into the 12 sons of Jacob. And they are wrongfully create, uh, credited the 12 sons of Jacob instead of crediting the original 12 African continent tribes in which the Giza Sphinx lion in which we now see in front of the Isaiah 1919 Giza pyramid as a black man faced upon a lion's body with the origin of ancient Judaism. Now as we see that the Babylonian stealth pyramid civilization of Ham is where the 12 sons of Jacob supposedly left their father in Iraq and Babylon as they entered into ancient Egypt and started ancient Judaism. However, this is a flawed story in which we are now reading in our Afro-American churches. Whereas, the if we draw 12 lines from South Africa to North, horizontal east to west line, and then view them with satellite imagery, we will see nothing but African tribes living in each of the 12 geographic land surface lines and which brings us into the terminology in which I call the original 12 African continent tribes in which the book of Genesis 49 chapter 8 verse counting Ethiopian lion sphinx of uh, ancient Judea and Jerusalem which is mentioned in Ezra 1 3 let us go to Jerusalem which is located in the land of Judah it does not say uh, Jerusalem is located in the European far state of Israel so as we go back to the 12 African continent tribes we look at the 11th line from outer space in northern Africa. Now that's the Isaiah 1919 Giza Pyramid era. But as we look at the opening uh, image in this video, we see that the dome of the rock, outer wall that supports the Golden Dome, right? That wall that supports the Golden Dome upon the octagonal building structure in Jerusalem. That wall has stone rectangular window frames in it. And in each stone rectangular window frame, we see a stealth pyramid, globe earth Mercator projection. projection. Now, if we go to Bowden and Lalibala, we're going to see the stone eat the open cross-shaped building structure uh, that's connected to Iraq and Babylon. And the Stealth Pyramid of Saqqar, Stealth Pyramid of Babylon, Stealth Pyramid of Dosha. So as we look at these elongated headed Africans that was created in Genesis 126, which no longer exists on the surface of planet Earth, being credited with the Global Earth Stealth Pyramid Mercator projection. Now, out of the two Africans, right? that was created, Genesis 126, first elongated hit African Adam, such as we see in front of the, uh, around ancient Egypt, like the elongated hit African King Tut, Pharaoh, and Moses, and all of the elongated hit sons of God that the mistranslated King James Bible read, uh, uh, failed to uh, mention. They only focus on the book of Genesis 2-7, normal shape hit African Adamic race in which populated the entire African continent from south to north. Hence come the terminology in which we have now rediscovered and in which are called the 12 African continent tribes. They are normal shape headed Africans, whereas if you draw 11 lines from South Africa to north, the 11th line is where the Isaiah 1990 Giza pyramids are. Now take a look at the um, globe birth star pyramid projection that appears in the dome of the rock outer wall that supports the golden dome. This is the uh, African continent, now look at it, appearing halfway level within the stealth pyramid. Now what's the image of a stealth pyramid? Okay, it's like if you stack five blocks on top of one another, on the left and right side, that they form a step that you walk upon. Now you do the same thing with the uh, uh, right side, stack five blocks on top of one another, that they form a step that you walk upon. Now stand back and look at it, that's the African stealth pyramid of Dosha. Stealth Pyramid of Sarkar, Stealth Pyramid of Babylon in Iraq, where the so-called 12 sons of Jacob was supposedly leaving their father, the elongated father Yakub. Okay. So now as they enter into ancient Egypt. So the problem with this biblical European Bible lie is that we already have an existing black African normal shape headed lion sphinx of ancient Judea and Jerusalem. Okay, as the origin of Judaism. So as the European Gentile nations discredited the African continent couching lion sphinx of Judea and Jerusalem, we now go back to Ethiopia, Stone Cross Shea Building Structure and Lalibala. As we look at it from a helicopter, we're looking at a Stone Cross Shea Building Structure that has a base, Stealth Pyramid E base. All right, now that's the same Stealth Pyramid we see in the Dome of the Rock Outer Wall, a stone rectangular one from that supports the Golden Dome. So as we look at this rediscovery of the architectural origin of the Dome of the Rock being not connected to any European false man-based 
So this octagonal building structure is not related to any false man-based Lord God world religion characters such as Jesus or Jehovah. They both have a penis underneath their white bulb. Since this four feet tall alien uh, with an elongated head, three fingers and one thumb on each hand, and smooth skin between his legs where a woman's vagina would be, this alien cannot be called a man, even though this alien stands about four feet tall, has big black oval shaped eyes, but this is the elongated headed Old Testament glowing world in the world like UFO alien that created the first elongated head African Adam in Genesis 126, which no longer exists upon the surface of planet Earth. So as we uh, look at this dome in the rock, octagonal building structure that has four doors or canopies as doors, right? A canopy over the doors. Okay, next to the canopy on the octagonal building structure outer wall surface, we see a stone rectangular window frame that has dual stone exits, one above the other. Now on the blank sheet of paper, if you write two white exits the thickness of your little finger, one, so you write one above the other on the blank sheet of paper, two white stone exits or two stone axes. Okay, the thickness of your finger. If you draw a straight line down from the top of the corner of the axis so that they intersect with the bottom corner axis, uh, uh, X corners, then you do a line straight down the middle, you have just generated a black African Ethiopian stone cross-shaped building structure in Lali Bob. In other words, we have 100% geometrically proven that the architectural building uh, structure in Lali Bala is the origin of the Dome of the Rock octagonal building structure in Jerusalem. Now we see this with the dual stone axis uh, analogy uh, 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 schematics. And so now we go back to the Stel Premier E in the outer wall that supports the Golden Dome. We have come full circle to the Black African Calcine Ethiopian Lion Sphinx of Genesis 49, chapter 8, verse, origin of uh, ancient Judaism. As his face of as his face appears in front of the Isaiah 1990 keeps appearance. Now, uh, thank you for viewing these great archaeological, theological, and astronomical discoveries. For more information, you may visit my Facebook, uh, Afro-American Archaeology and Theology, and page.